They say the best camera is the one in your pocket, but convenience comes at a cost. Today's slimline smartphones are brilliant as touchscreens and telephones, but try to use them for any serious photography and they become an ergonomic nightmare. The hardware buttons don't function as you think they will, and the software controls never seem to be in the right place. All the finger yoga in the world won't help you take a left-handed selfie. And that is why Just Mobile has created this, the Shutter Grip. It easily connects to pretty much any smartphone out there, case or no case, and connects via Bluetooth to control your camera. Once it's paired, you simply need to press the button and it will automatically connect. And that is where the magic begins. Simple, compatible and adaptable, and with none of the social stigma of a selfie stick, the Just Mobile Shutter Grip is everything smartphone photographers have been waiting for. But we need your support to take this concept into production. So, give us your backing, tell your friends, and get ready to shoot. Today we're going to be talking all about the S1Ws. Professor Griff, Flavor Flav, Chuck D, we going all... The S1? It's not the S1W? The shoulder part S1? So basically, we ain't talking about public enemy at all in this episode. Hey guys, how y'all doing out there? My name is Malik, and today I'm bringing you the review of the Shoulder Part S1 smartphone rig. The Shoulder Part S1 is a high quality grip consisting of three pieces. The grip, a strap, and a weight. It is a super solid and portable solution for holding your smartphone on a tripod, in the hand, or as a stand. The S1 is a sturdy little device. It's made out of a durable plastic that is drenched in a high resistant polymer. There's a spring in the center of the device which helps to open it and an adjustable screw that helps to securely hold your smartphone in place. The angled grips are made of soft rubber to protect and firmly hold your phone in the device. The quarter 20 tripod thread is made of machined brass for extra strength and durability. The grip extension makes it comfortable to hold the S1 in your hand while shooting. It is machined from some kind of space age, aerospace grade aluminum, and it has an anodized matte black finish to make it look super sexy. The extra weight that this adds to the shoulder part S1 makes it feel extra secure and solid. The wrist strap is basically a safety feature that mitigates the chances of you dropping the S1 and turning your smartphone into a bunch of useless shrapnel. It's super strong and it has a thick piece of suede at the end to make it even stronger where it connects between the tripod mount and the weight. It's a good practice to make sure the suede piece is facing towards you as it makes it easier to put your hand through the strap when you're ready to start shooting. The shoulder part S1 can be mounted to all tripods equipped with a quarter 20 inch screw. When using an S1 on a tripod, you can take full advantage of all of your smartphone features such as panoramas and time-lapse videos. This allows you to take your mobile phone shooting to the next level. When you go off tripod, you can mount the weighted extension and wrist strap to the end of the S1 and hold your phone comfortably and securely in your hand. 
This allows you to add movement to your shots, which adds production value to your videos. The S1 can also be used as a convenient stand. Use it to hold your phone upright while editing your videos, using your favorite app, or navigating to that secluded spot on the beach to meet up with your honey dip. The shoulder part S1 can accommodate mobile devices from 48 millimeters to 93 millimeters in width, which means it can handle all the iPhone 6 Plus you throw at it. Mounting your smartphone to the S1 is super easy. Simply open the S1, slide in your phone so the lens is at the opposite end of the S1, hold down the grip, and turn the thumb screw until it feels tight on your phone. Now your smartphone is safe and secure. One thing that I didn't like about the shoulder part S1 was the thumb screw. You can actually over tighten it and damage your phone if you're not careful. It would have been nice if shoulder part developed a means to make the thumb screw stop once it reached a certain level of tightness. I love the fact that the S1 is lightweight as it makes it easy to take it anywhere I go. Since I purchased it, I find myself regularly capturing content at places where I wouldn't before due to not wanting to carry around my DSLR and a bunch of gear. Because I always have my phone with me, all I have to do now is pop the S1 in my pocket and I'm ready to shoot. I also love the ergonomics of the S1. It is easy to hold in your hand and use your thumb to press the record button or access other features on your phone. All right guys, that's a wrap. Overall, I'm feeling the shoulder part S1. If you plan to mount your smartphone to it carefully, I definitely recommend copping the S1. If you like this content and want to see more, leave me a thumbs up. If you got any questions, hit me up with a comment and I'll get back with you. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.